now we discuss the charge transfer transition let us consider this metal complex now we define the charge transfer transition transfer of uh, an electron from one atom to another atom within the complex is known as charge transfer transition now we can see the transfer of an electron from ligand to the central metal atom is known as charge transfer transition this type of charge transfer transition is known as lmct or ligand to metal charge transfer transition next we can see the transfer of an electron from metal to the ligand this type of transition is known as mlct or metal to ligand charge transfer transition next uh, we see the general molecular orbital picture of charge transfer transition this is the central metal ion of the d orbital and this is the ligands of the p orbitals here i am not going to splitting the d and the p orbitals to avoid the complications and also i am going to consider the single electron to simplify this a uh, picture now we can uh, see the transfer of an electron from p orbital of the ligand to the d orbital of the central metal ion this type of uh, transition is known as ligand to metal charge transfer transition this transition is also known as p to d type transition by laput allowed transition here the spin direction is not changed so this is spin allowed transition the energy gap between these two molecular orbital is known as lmct energy gap lowering the energy of empty metal orbitals gives an ion is expected to correlate with the lower lmct this lowering of d orbital can be achieved by using the high oxidation state of the central metal ion because it will have low d electron count here the ligand act as electron donor central metal ion can act as electron acceptor the lmct energy gap can also reduced by using the high energy non bonding orbitals for example uh, among the halo ligands iodide can have the high energy non bonding orbitals the, it can reduce the lmct energy gap next we see the another transition here the d orbital of the central metal ion of the electron can excite to the anti bonding orbital of the ligand this type of uh, transition is known as metal to ligand charge transfer transition this transition is uh, d to p type uh, transition by laput allowed transition this is also spin allowed transition because the spin direction is not changed here the energy gap between these two molecular orbital is known as mlct energy gap here the central metal ion is electron donor and the ligand can act as electron acceptor the mlct energy gap can be reduced by using the pi accepting ligands because this pi accepting ligands having low lying empty anti bonding orbital and using a low oxidation state of the central metal ion this uh, can reduce the mlct energy gap and facilitate the charge transfer transition in the next video we will discuss the charge transfer transition for the individual molecule thank you